So, grandmother, 74 years of age, jailed over €28,000 insurance fraud. Mother of 14 um, has been sentenced to three and a half years with one year suspended by the judge today. So, multiple times over the years, back to 2012, um, this lady has been claiming. So, obviously, the more claims that you put in, tomorrow they put the eye on you so unfortunately this lady has to serve a bit of time in prison and i know look the law is the law and i know she's broken the law and some will say it's fair and some will say it's not and i don't think it is i think at that age 74 years of age didn't have to jail her like why does this lady start doing this kind of behavior in her 60s if she's 74 now and apparently she started this in 2012 and yes it took the insurance companies a long long time and um, to get this lady but come on 74 years of age she apologized to the judge today she said sorry i won't do it again and the judge told her i have to punish you and it's very frustrating when you see other crimes get a more lenient sentence than what this lady got today but that's the justice system in this country, inconsistent. I'd say she'd probably serve about six, seven months, but doesn't doesn't seem right to me. And I know a lot of you are gonna be like, ah, oh, the law is the law, she broke the law. But they're obviously making an example of her, of a 74 year old woman. And I know bogey claims is something that's been going on a long, long, long time. And it'll probably go on for another long, long, long more time. But to make an example of this woman, it's absolutely shameful. And yeah, she put in uh, multiple claims. Uh, one was on the Dublin bus, under 40. Um, so who, <laughs> who hasn't done a uh, bogey claim against Dublin bus, for fuck's sake? Um, another one was Tesco's, and one was in the street. Yeah, look. Um, anyway, it just doesn't sit right with me. Free Winfred Long Lawrence now. Free Winnie, free Winnie, free Winnie, free Winnie. Let her out, let her out, let her out. Your boy said... Whoa! That code is a kip.